What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Gemini, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading for sign of Gemini. It's bonus for June of 2022. This covers an AP of Gemini and any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Earth, and Moon energy for your charts. Don't forget the base. Uh, sorry, not the BS. Ah, no, not the BS. Uh, don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply that apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Free general collective reading for sign of Gemini. Um, I encourage everyone to check out their sun, moon, rising, and north node signs as well. Um, you might possibly find message or messages that apply for you or your situation in those signs as well. Also, cross, cross watchers are always welcome as well. Um, just saying, just saying. These are psychic intuitive messages, so one may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. So you plug it in however it resonates and applies in your own particular situation and life, however that resonates and applies for you, Gemini, okay? Um, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're at 13,160 subscribers, so thanks so much for all the love and support. If you think anyone else would like my channel, um, please feel free to share my channel very publicly via word of mouth and social media. I very much appreciate it, you guys. It helps support a single mom and one of her income streams, single mom and two kids. So I very much appreciate it. Okay, so um, I received a couple channelings. Um, I heard Jim and I, and then I received a couple ch channelings. Um, so I'm going to do yours next. Stingray, Vulture. So I'm going to deliver them. Um, just saying, just saying. Love you guys so much. I do, I do, I do, do. Okay. So the first one I heard seeing through the BS and I heard it real freaking big, man. And honestly, it was a man's voice I heard. So it was not a channeling from the um, source. It wasn't a channeling from source. This was, I feel telepathic communication. I heard a man's voice very loud and very angrily. I heard see, like, seeing through the BS. Kind of like that. And I'm serious. Seeing through the BS. Is that manly? Uh, and I'm just being for real. So I think um, a man is seeing through the BS. Um, or maybe it's a woman in her masculine, but it was a man I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Seeing through the BS. Um, one of you guys, I'm feeling, you plug it in, how it resonates, okay? Um, I feel you can be masculine or feminine, but a man is out there seeing through the BS. I'll tell you that right now. Um they already have or they're about to how that resonates and applies um the second message i heard was um a pi i'm um, sorry not a pisces a gemini masculine is about to find out a pisces feminine is pregnant not by him baby mama is what i heard it is about to piss him off in a huge way so that could be what this man is seeing through the bs about possibly i mean i don't know i'm not him um, but I am picking him up very strong, and that's for damn sure. Spirit messages you have reflect this. So, uh, Gemini Masculine, if this resonates for you, you are about to find out your pet, a Pisces femme baby mama. Um, she's been pleasing. Um, somebody's been pleasing her, just saying. Um, she, you're about to find out she's pregnant. She's your baby mama, I heard. So, I don't feel you actually had like a actual copacetic, healthy, building and growing relationship. I feel it was like a one night stand or a, a situation ship or a sneaky link or something. But how will that resonate? You're about to find out she is pregnant by a um, another man. And it's about to piss you off in a huge way. You plug it in how it resonates, sir. Um, by the way, everybody, I'm on Yelp. I'm on Yelp. Uh, Y-E-L-P, if anybody wants to leave me a positive review on uh, Yelp, I'd very much appreciate it. It's a business page for business owners. And um, it's on, on there is High Priestess Intuition, online psychic intuitive messages. If anybody wants to check me out, I'd appreciate all the um, positive reviews. I mean, I deliver the good and bad on here. So if it's been resonating with you, good or bad, that means my services are, um, they're, they're, they're resonating and that means i'm pulling in your energy which is the whole point of this 
Um, I pull in you guys' energy to look, deliver you do, uh, psychic intuitive messages. A lot of them are um, futuristic messages. So that's, I mean, psychic medium services. Just saying, just saying. It. So I appreciate any and all reviews. Spirit messages you have signed a Gemini. So a, uh, a Gemini masculine is about to find out his Pisces femme baby mama is about to, uh, is pregnant by someone that's not him. Apparently he's about to be up in his feels about this. Um, you plug it in how it resonates, sir. I am so I'm sorry about this, but it doesn't sound like y'all were together. So I mean, I'm not sure. You only you know your story, not anybody else. But I did hear baby mama. Fear messages you have for Sanjima. Rehabilitation is about to become very significant in Gemini's life. For some, physical rehabilitation. For some, drug rehabilitation. For some, it's you. For some, it's somebody you're connected to. Okay, I heard rehabil rehabilitate. rehabilitation is about to become significant in one of you guys' life. For some, it's physical rehabilitation. For some, it's drug rehabilitation. For some, it's you. For some, it's somebody you're connected to. So, only you know your story and situation, not anybody else. I feel you could be a masculine or feminine if that message or messages apply for you. You plug it in, how it resonates. Spirit messages you have, Sunday Gemini. And a Gemini feminine and a Scorpio feminine's relationship is about to crumble through many series of chain events. Irreparable. About to become irreparable. Supposed friends in the past. There's about to be a huge betrayal here. Um, this Scorpio Femme is about to betray this Gemini Femme in a huge way. Oh my lord. You plug it in. How it resonates Gemini Femme. So if this resonates for you, it's a supposed friend relationship with a Scorpio Femme. They could have Scorps in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Femme, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. If this resonates for you, ma'am, you're a Gemini Femme. Um... Apparently, she's about to stab you in the back. It's like 10 of swords, except like 20 or 30 damn swords in the back. Eh, 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 like things. Um, I heard it's about to be irreparable. So, whatever the hell she's about to do behind your back, um, it sounds like you're about to find out about it. And it's about to be irreparable. So, um, it sounds like you are about to choose to block her or, um, or cut her out of your life. And honestly, if I, mean, if I was you, I would do the same thing because... You keep coming back, it's like disrespecting yourself um, if you know this person has betrayed you. That's the way I look at it. It's disrespecting yourself, your self-value, self-worth, and um, and all that. So I don't blame you for um, if you are the one that's choosing to block her out of your life, ma'am. Um, but however that resonates, it applies. Only you know the actions you're going to take when you, it sounds like you find out about this um, betrayal. For some, you might have already found out about it. But it's um, a Scorpio Feminine supposed friends so like a frenemy energy you plug it in how it resonates ma'am spirit messages you have signed gemini i think one of you guys is stubborn over person people place family your situation or someone stubborn over you because it take me forever to get the cards out spirit messages you have signed gemini A Scorpio masculine that has been trying very hard to block a Leo feminine through many series of chain events. It's a, the sieve is about to break open. Know this. Okay, Gemini. So you're dealing with a Leo fem and a Scorpio masculine. Apparently, a um, Scorpio masculine has been trying to block a Leo fem in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, but I heard through many series of chain events, this sieve is about to break open. So. The dam's about to break open. It's about to break open. Um, she's about to be unblocked in some shape, form, or fashion. How that resonates and applies in one's life. It is a Leo Femme and it's a uh, Scorpio Masculine. Uh, these are, it's not you, um, Gemini. It is, I think, a Leo Femme and a Scorpio Masculine, you know, if um, that message applies for you. Okay, so we have, for some, you could be dealing with a... Um, air, air sign or water sign, stingray and vulture, um, air sign or water sign. For some, they could have uh, Gemini, if you are dealing with air sign, possibly, um, they could have Gemini Libra Aquarius or um, uh, 
Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Wolf, Moon, Midheaven, and Jupiter charts, if you are. Okay, we have Wedge. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. Eagle, tri triumph over troubles and obstacles. Woman, dealings or relationships with a woman. A home tarot card reader you were connected to is about to be arrested for drugs soon. Shrooms. Taking, taking shrooms to produce spiritual downloads. Oh my lord! What the hell? Well, we have the mushrooms card. It is a home tarot card reader if this message applies for you, Gemini. It is the home tarot card reader you're connected to in some shape, form, or fashion. For some, it could be a thin energy because we're pulling in woman. Um, but however that resonates, I heard she's been taking shrooms to produce spiritual downloads. Through many series of chain events, she's about to be arrested soon for drugs. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. It's a home tarot card reader. So like I do an online public platform like this. It's somebody that allows client or clients in their home. I don't allow clients in my home because I was getting stalked for so damn long. Um, but whoever this person is, they do. And they don't get true spiritual downloads like I do. They take drugs. I heard specifically shrooms to produce um, delusional type behavior and um i don't know i've never taken shrooms i don't know how this shit works but somehow they're taking shrooms to produce some kind of hallucinogenic effect to produce spiritual downloads that's not the way it works and that's just the damn truth oh my god they are about to be busted in a huge ass way a gemini is about to help bust them they are about to be busted in a huge ass way and a gemini is about to help bust them Okay, Gemini, so you're highly intuitive, man. You know what the hell's going on. Um, one, I feel you might work for the police, or you might be an investigator, or you just might be a client that goes and visits them and realizes they're not the fucking real deal, or maybe you see the shrooms. I don't even know what shrooms look like um, in real life. I have to Google that shit. Um, I mean, I've seen them in pictures before, but I've never seen them like in real life. I don't hang around people, period. Um, much less hang around people enough to see drugs in the 3D. So I don't know, but I'll have to Google that. But maybe you see them at their home or notice they're acting funky. I don't know. But one of you guys is onto them and you're highly freaking intuitive. We have the mushrooms. You plug it in, how it resonates. This is so juicy already. We're at 1240. Number 18 could be very significant number in one's life. Number 18, pleasure. Uh, could be a possible age of uh, adult. Maybe you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number of one's life. Confirmation from a kitty. Come on, fat boy. Okay. And I, my dishwasher's going, so I apologize for the sound. But when I bought the dishwasher, I got the lowest decibel rating on it. So I can't really hear it. I don't think you guys can, but I just wanted to disclaimer that too. It's so nice and quiet. Um compared to some dishwashers. Some dishwashers have a very high decibel rating. This one has a very low. It's so wonderful. And it's stainless steel. Just, just lay on you. I'm very happy about it. And mushrooms. Stingray. A Pisces wearing wiretapping is about to become very significant in Gemini's life. What the hell, man? I was picking up some Pisces and was wiretapping on them. Like, a, what, three weeks ago or four weeks ago? You have to go back and check the reading. You plug it in how it resonates. A Pisces wearing wiretapping is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. Workplace situation. For some, off-duty. Workplace situation and for one off-duty? Off-duty. So, off-duty? So, you're an officer? Or you, I heard off-duty. So, maybe for some, I feel you're an officer. For some, it's a workplace situation. So, I don't feel you are a, um, an officer. I feel you 
or in a workplace situation. For some, I heard off duty. So I think you're an officer and you're dealing with this Piscean off duty. Like you're off duty. Um, you can be masculine or femme Gemini. Whoever this Piscean is, if being masculine or femme Pisces, um, the Pisces I was pulling in that other reading was Pisces femme. So for some, I feel it could be a Pisces femme. For some, it could be somebody else. But some kind of Piscean wearing wire, wire typing is about to become very significant to you, whether you are officer of the law or not. Um, however that resonates, dear Lord have mercy. So I think she's about to sting, sting somebody, or she's trying to sting somebody wearing this wire tapping crap. Um, however that resonates, um, uh, I don't, I heard wearing wire tapping. So I think it might be like a, I don't know. I, I don't know what the hell this entails. I'm assuming it's something they're wearing on their body, or maybe it's, a device they've been planted in their phone when the phone comes through and they can um somebody else can hear the conversations or what have you what have you but some kind of wearing of wiretapping how that resonates she's trying to um he or she's trying to sting somebody um they're just trying to set somebody up is what i'm feeling the stingray the stinging energy trying to set somebody up um about to set their own self up in a huge ass way. About to set their own self up in a huge ass way. <sighs> Dear Lord. A warrant is out for a water sign's arrest. Did not show up to court. This person is about to become very significant in Gemini's life soon. Oh my lord. A warrant is out. And a fire sign. A warrant is out for a water sign and a fire sign. They did not show up for court. Uh, it's about to become very significant in Gemini's life. You guys show up for court. What the hell, man? As much as I hated doing that shit the other day, I still did it. And that's just the damn truth. Um, I hated doing that shit. But I, I mean, I've always paid my tickets or went to the court dates or what have you, what have you. Because that's what you're supposed to do. Because if you don't, it clearly states on the paperwork, a warrant will be issued for your arrest. And that's the truth. You guys. I mean, I'm not saying that you it could be somebody you're connected to. But dear God Almighty. You plug it in how it resonates. So, however that resonates, somebody didn't show up for court. Either a fire sign or a water sign. It's not you, Gemini. It's somebody you're connected to. Some kind of fire sign or water sign energy. I can feel they could be a masculine or a femme. Fire sign or water sign. They could have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Aries, Leo, Sag, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hammer, Jupiter, charts. But however that resonates, they're about to become significant in your life. So, I don't know if this, they're about to become significant in a positive or negative way. Um, heard a... Um, Warrant's been issued for their arrest, so uh, maybe you're an officer about to go pick them up, or I don't know how that works. I don't know how that works, man. I don't know how that works. I'm not an officer of the law, but some, I, I can just tell you that a warrant has been issued for their arrest, and they're about to become significant in your life, so however you're about to become significant in their life, you plug it in how it resonates. Yikes! If anybody needs to hear this, please go to your court dates, you guys. I'm serious. It may come on now. Vulture. A particular Libra is about to really contact you trying to get information. Really, really, really trying to contact you. Specific information. On a feminine energy. It would not be smart to give it. You have given it in the past. Okay, I heard a particular um, Libra. Um, this is not work related. I heard this is not work related. So this is specific. So whoever this is for, this is not work related. I'll tell you that. That's specific in here. So. It's not work-related. 
it is some other kind of related. I'm feeling stalkery or creepy vibes. Um, I heard you've given this information in the past on this um, fem energy um, to this Libra. It can be a masculine or fem Libra, but however this resonates, it's not work, work related. I'll tell you that. That's a specific for whoever that's for, but I heard it wouldn't be smart to give it. You've given it in the past. So whoever you are and how this applies to Gemini, I feel you can be masculine or fem Gemini. Um, hopefully use your best intuition here. Um, somehow you're connected to this um, fem energy or you used to be. However that resonates, I heard it wouldn't be smart to give it. So, um, and it's not work related, I'll tell you that. So there being a vulture, some kind of Libra energy, masculine or fem leaves, they could have Libra and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or fem in heaven, Jupiter charts. But however that resonates, I feel there being a vulture energy to you, trying to pick, pick, pick at you, pick, pick, pick at you, trying to, I mean, not like pick on you, but pick you for information. They're trying to pick you for information, like a vulture picking at their dead carcass is what I'm feeling. And I'm just being for real, for real, um, if that resonates. A Gemini is about to be busted in a graveyard soon. Finally, through many series of chain of events. Heavy necromancy. This is so shit. This is some nasty shit. Oh my god. I mean, there's some good messages in here and, and, and low vibrational. This is low vibrational. Whoever this low vibrational Gemini is, necromancer. Um, so they're on the dark side, using dark side necromancy, basically, uh, on dead bodies, um, in a graveyard. Uh, this, wow, man. I heard they're finally about to be busted. It has sounds like in the graveyard through many series of chain of events. Maybe you're a high vibrational Gemini about to bust this, um, crazy ass person in the graveyard for, ne for necromancy. Um, this is a necromancing, um, energy I'm feeling. They're using dark side black magic on dead bodies, basically. Oh my god. Woo! We're moving on. Shit! Wedge, someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. Drug paraphernalia is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. One, a traffic stop. One, a friend will leave it at your home. Be very smart to dispose of it immediately. Oh, dear God. I heard um, drug paraphernalia is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. For one, it's a traffic stop. So, I... I feel that I could go both ways. Maybe you're the officer about to pull over the uh, person and you're about to find this drug paraphernalia or you are the driver or passenger and there's drug paraphernalia in the vehicle. How that resonates. I feel it can go both ways. But some kind of drug paraphernalia in a vehicle for situation one. Situation two, um, it's your home, it sounds like, and your friend or friends is about to leave drug paraphernalia in your home. I'd be, I heard it would be very smart to dispose of it immediately. So whatever kind of drug paraphernalia that is, I don't know if it's a pipe, a bong, a, a what have you, what have you. I, I don't know. I don't have friends and I don't um, associate with people enough to know what the drug, hip drug paraphernalia is these days. So I don't know. How that resonates, Gemini? Um, someone is trying, kind of trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. I feel this is a drug paraphernalia energy. Um, if you were the driver of the vehicle and that message one applies for you, I would be very careful who I allow in my vehicle. And I'm just being for real. Because if you are the driver and your frenzies are having drug paraphernalia up in your damn vehicle and you get pulled over and the officer pulls you over, that's going to be on you, man. Um, so I would be careful. I think this is a drug paraphernalia energy in this aspect. Somebody needs to be careful who they're allowing in their home and their vehicle. Um, for some, I feel you can be the officer about to pull these people over for some, but you plug it in how it resonates because I am pulling an officer in. Um, 
for one of you guys. Eagle triumph over troubles and obstacles. A Gemini is about to see very clearly about a situation of the past involving a family. Very clearly. They did not in the past. It's about to make them, uh, cause them to create many positive series of chain events for this family. They realized they were wronged in a huge way. Confirmation from my fat boy. Come on, fat boy. So I heard a Gemini is about to see very clearly about a situation that happened with the family. In the past, they did not see clearly in the past. So if this resonates for you, Gemini, you didn't see clearly about the situation with the family in the past, but now you are or you're about to have that resonates. I heard you're gonna it's gonna cause you to create many positive series of chain events for this family. So whatever the positive series of chain events it is you're about to create for this family, you're about to do it. So um you plug it in how it resonates. So that's good. I mean, it sounds like your perception was off in the past, but it sounds like maybe somebody tried to manipulate you. Um, or they did manipulate you, manipulate your perception is what I'm feeling. Um, but you're seeing clearly now or you're about to. And that's good. That's good. So you're triumphing over that, um, I think, over mental manipulation of the past. And you're about to create many positive series of chain events for the family. Uh, now, whatever they are, I don't know. Only you know the positive series of chain events you're going to create for this family, not anybody else, okay? Let me see if I hear anything else. A significant restaurant visit is about to become very significant in Gemini's life. For one, you work there. For one, you do you do not. You're going to purvey the restaurant. It is a significant interaction with a feminine energy. Okay, so significant restaurant interaction. If this resonates for you, for some, you are an um, employee at the restaurant. For some, you are not. It sounds like you're going to be a customer at this restaurant. Um, but however that resonates, um, it's some kind of significant interaction with the feminine energy. It's about to become very significant. Whether you're the customer at this restaurant, it sounds like it's upcoming. This message is upcoming. It hasn't happened yet. So whether you're the customer at the restaurant or you are a employee at the restaurant, a, a significant interaction with the feminine energy is going to become significant. So I feel this could be, um, a, if you are an employee at the restaurant, I feel this could be a customer or customers. I do. Um, this is exactly what I feel. If you're the employee, if you are the um, purveyor of service or services at this restaurant, so you're a customer, I feel this could be your waitress or a manager or something of that nature, a waitress or a manager or another purveyor another customer at the restaurant. Um, how that resonates. For some, she could hit on your ass. Um, I didn't hear any of that, but I'm just being real, real. For some, she could hit on you. Um, I didn't hear she was going to, but maybe. Just saying, just saying. Let's see if I hear anything else. For one, you're going to give her your number. For one, she will hit on you. For one, she's going to be very complaining. Oh, shit. Whoa. I heard for one, you're going to, you are going to give her your number. For one, she's going to hit on you. I, I kind of feel that. I told you all that. And for one, um, she's going to be very complaining. So, like a carrot. She will be like a carrot. Um, if you plug it in, how it resonates. Whether you are the uh, employee at the restaurant or you are going to be a customer at the restaurant. For some, I feel it could have a bar in it because um, I heard she's going to hit on you. So for some, I feel this could be a restaurant and bar grill type of thing is what I'm feeling for some. 
Um, and I'm just being real, real because just saying, just saying. Mushrooms. We got the message in here earlier about the home care call reader about to be exposed for taking damn shrooms and they're, they're about to be basically arrested for drugs. Um, just throwing that out there. Our garden is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. Our garden is about to become very significant in a Gemini's life. So some kind of garden energy. So you plug it in how it resonates. So garden energy. Pleasure. A Gemini is about to be asked to become a swinger. You, For some, you have swung before. You are going to turn down this time. It is going to piss the person off that asked you to do this. For some, it is a co-worker. Oh, shit. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow. So for some of you guys, um, for some, it's your co-worker about to ask you to become a swinger. And for some, you've swung before. For some, um, you haven't. But... And for some, it's a co-worker, for some, it's not. But however that resonates, they're about to ask you to swing, either newly swing or swing again. How that resonates, I heard you're going to turn them down. You're going to turn them down, and it's going to piss them off. So they want some nookie. They want some nookie, 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 um, some side nookie from you, Gemini. Um, they want you to be uh, part of their swinging debacle. Um, I hope, ew, ew. <laughs> For some, you're about to buy an inflatable person. Whoa. For some, you're about to buy an inflatable person. I'm not judging that. I actually think that's very healthy, to be honest. I think that's very healthy because um, inflatable person energy, um, I don't judge that. I think that's great. I would consider doing that. If I had enough money, you better believe I'd get me a man with an extra large penis and a lot of lube. And I would have fun riding him all night. And that's just the damn truth. STD free and orgasmic complete. I mean, I'm just being for real, for real. I think that's wonderful, whoever you are, sir or ma'am, about to buy you an inflatable person. I heard an inflatable person, so I don't think it's one of those real, feels like a real person, moans and all that. But at least it's something. Um, if I was going to do it, it'd be a real, like, a uh, person... They'd have to moan, and they'd have to have a real big penis, and um, it ha I mean, maybe it vibrates or shakes or whatever the hell the features are on those things, but um, I'd really go all for it if I was going to get one of those. Until then, I'll just use my finger. But my point is, you're taking good steps here. 